National Testing Agency organize ICAR exam, a national level exam offering admission to UG professional bachelor degree courses in the field of agriculture. The application form of ICR 2022 will be shortly published on their official website and we will be updated when the application starts. And in today's video, we are going to discuss what are the documents or what are the things you have to keep in ready before the application starts. So, candidate must keep the following information ready before filling the online application form. The first thing to be keep ready is a government identity card like Aadhaar card, election card, ration card, bank account number, PAN number or any other valid government ID card. The next one is an address for communication. Along with the address, you have to keep a valid mobile number and email ID for the communication purpose. Remember one thing, the address, mobile number and email ID should be belongs to you and your parents only. Any other address or mobile number other than yours will not be accepted. And next is the most important thing to keep ready is a scanned image of the latest photograph. So when comes about the candidate's photograph details, the photograph must be taken recently. And please note, the photograph should not be with any kind of cap or goggles. If the candidate are using spectacles for a while, it is allowed. And one of the most important thing to notice, 80% of the face should be clearly visible with a white background. Please note, the photographs which is unclear are liable to be rejected. Candidates may please note that if it is found that the photograph uploaded is fabricated, that is D-shaped or seems to be handmade or computer made, the form of the candidate will be rejected and the same would be considered as using unfairness. The application without photograph shall be rejected. So all candidates should take a recent photograph and please note the photograph need not to be attested. Candidates are advised to take 6 to 8 passport size color photograph with the white background. And this passport size photograph is used for uploading on online application form and also for pasting on the attendance sheet at the examination center. And the most important thing to be noted about the photograph is the candidate should scan their for passport size photograph for uploading and the file size must be between 10 KB to 200 KB. And the scanned image of the photograph should be in JPG format only within the size of 10 KB to 200 KB. It is the most important thing to be noted. The next one should be keep in ready is a scanned image of the signature. Candidates are required to upload their full signature in running handwriting in the appropriate box given in the online application form. Please note, writing full name in the box in capital letters would not be accepted as signature and the application form will be rejected. And also not unsigned online application form will also be rejected. So all candidates are required to upload their full signature in running handwriting only. The candidate should put his full signature on white paper with the black ink pen and scan for uploading. And when comes above the file size, the size must be between 4 KB to 30 KB. And candidate must ensure that the uploaded images are clear and proper. The next one is a scanned image of thumb impression. 
When comes about the thumb impression, candidates are required to upload a thumb impression in the appropriate box given in the online application form. And one of the most important thing to note about thumb impression is all the male candidates have to use their left hand thumb impression and all the female candidates have to use right hand thumb impression. So it is most important thing to be not. And the file size must be between 3 KB to 30 KB. Please note all the male candidates should use left thumb impression and females have to use right thumb impression in the file size of 3 KB to 30 KB. And the next one to be keeping ready is a bank account details for the payment of fee for uploading as a part of submission of online application. And there are mainly consist of three methods for the fee payment. And after completing the online application form, candidates have to pay the examination fee choosing the three methods. And the first one is through your debit card or credit card. And candidates need to check the validity of your debit or credit card while logging onto the website for submitting the application form. And the second one is through net banking. Before choosing net banking, check the balance in account and keep all the credentials ready while logging onto the website. And the third method is you can use UPI or Paytm for paying the fees. And when comes about the fee structure, the application fee payable for the candidates of various category are for general category or unreserved category, the application fee is rupees 770. And for OBC and EWS category, the application fee is rupees 750. And for those candidates who belong to SC, ST, PWD, and transgender category, they have to pay only rupees 375 only. Now let's check some of the important points to be not before the application. In order to appear in ICAR, the candidates are required to apply online only. That is application form other than online mode shall not be accepted. And candidates should fill their complete postal address with the PIN code for further correspondence. And as I said earlier, Candidates must ensure that the email address and mobile number provided in the online application form are there all as which cannot be changed later. And please note the candidate should not give the postal address, mobile number or email ID of your coaching center in the online application form. Before submitting the online application form, shall ensure the eligibility to appear in the test and the eligibility and all other details on ICR 2022 has been already uploaded and the link will be provided in the description box. You can check it whether you are eligible or not. So the next one to notice online application form cannot be withdrawn once it is submitted successfully and all candidates are required to submit only one application form and if a candidate submit more than one application form, the candidature is likely to be cancelled. So, these are the things to be noted before ICR 2022 application. And when National Testing Agency releases the online application form, we will update you very soon.